when someone such as myself comes to town, you know, that, that people get whipped into a frenzy. You know, some of them even feel the need for psychological counseling. And again, that's not rational. You know, that's irrational. If they were being rational, they wouldn't have any need for psychological counseling. In fact, uh, they would welcome the opportunity to be challenged in their own opinions, beliefs, perspectives. You know, if, if you're right, if you can prove your point, you know, in the face of opposition, you know, in a, a debate type forum or a discussion, well, then you emerge stronger from that event. I learn all the time from people who I agree with and people I don't agree with. You know, I'm all ears and I'm open to uh, criticism, but if the criticism is just simply, uh, you know, a knee jerk, mindless, irrational, uh, hateful tirade against me, then of course I'm opposed to that and it smacks of, of great irony because, it, like I said, they are claiming to be against hate and yet they hate me. You know, where's the consistency? The Bible says a double-minded man is unstable in all of his ways. So that's what you know. I would say to the protesters out there, I would love nothing more than to be able to engage them. There have been some events in my experience where I have invade, uh, engaged large uh, you know, assemblies of people who were counter-protesting me, and, and it is useful, it's constructive.